this is the logo how it looks like the freeform app you're just gonna click it it is the really good apps to create the vision boards or the meeting notes because the size of this board is limitless like you can scroll it to like you will have very maximum space and at the bottom left you're gonna see the scale of it like you can zoom it to 400 you can zoom it to 7500 and you can create very informative and good mood boards for your meetings and or for your design strategy if you got any comments and if you want to improve any kind of the work or what you're planning like you can make the design ideas in it and any project related ideas like you can create a vision board with this method as well how can you use it what are different methods to use it so you can create your vision boards your meeting notes or your mood board presentation by using freeform app first of all when you want to create a new app just this is your the the basic board when you open it so on the top right you want to see this notepad with the pencil just click it then you can have your new board free form board okay in this free form board it's very basic and easy to use you can see at the center of the top you have these five gadgets to use it okay this first one is just for the pencil like you have the text pencil over here if i'm going to select it and if i'm going to write something for example i just write the design so it goes to convert it into a, a word text or digital text okay and the second we have the normal pencil app you can choose the color from here as well like i have these colors so you can write anything other pencil that you can use to sketch and to write like if you have something to sketch you can use it for the sketching and this is the crayon this this one is really good you, you just stab it twice you can increase the size of it as well and you can change the opacity of the color as well we have select the red so if you are going to like create some kind of image and you can decrease its opacity as well for the shadow or any kind of thing so you can have some kind of an artistic look in your mood boards as well and this is the paint this i really like this app but you can't use it over here that much it's just kind of you just have to make a, a portion of it and you can just color it and you can use it in any color and you can change its opacity as well like for example if i want to highlight this text i'm going to color it and i'm just going to change its opacity so this tool is very interesting i love it and then we have the eraser you have two options either you can choose the object release eraser how does it work just select the object eraser and just click on this object it's going to delete the whole object or either you can go for the pixel eraser in which you have to erase it by yourself like you erase the normal thing okay so later on then we have this kind of a selection tool just to go through your drawings and then select any image that you want either you can resize them okay free form and is that or you can you can do select this or if you can separate them duplicate them copy them and then you can move it around so it's kind of your cell basic selection tool and then you have to paste it here and then so this is the basic tool okay so then you have this kind of a sticker tool. you can select it and move it and just if you double tap it you can write a text for example if you're making a note so you have write the the zoom meeting and you can add the multiple notes to it it's kind of you know sticker notes that you use in your laptops and computers you can use it in the softboard sorry you can use it in your mood boards as well and you can just double tap it and you can write anything this the third the middle one <clears throat> this is my most favorite tool in this one because in this tool you will have lots of images this is the basic thing you can just select any one of those and you can resize it at any form that you want and you can write over it like if i want to write well until unique look and you have all these arrows like if i want to have this i can and you can change the size of it as well and you can change this 
outline as well you can change this color like you can play around a lot of things and then you can change this So the multiple just side click on anything and just select the image and you can increase the size of it as you want you want to create it. Just let me show you how you can create your pigeon book.